I think of myself as an architect, so the role of place is always very important. Siena has been an incredible place. Here in Siena, I started working with watercolors and developed something that you could say is like a language. And in that sense, I found the city and the people extremely inspiring. And I, I feel that these uh, watercolor experiments are just the beginning of something that started in Siena. I think of creativity as something that you back into. You're doing something and then something that you didn't expect happens. For example, I really like this palindrome square in one of the walls of the Duomo here in Siena. I started to develop a certain pattern that followed that kind of palindrome logic. So in a way, you could say that the things that I was seeing in the city or the things that I was trying to say sort of developed into these other elements. You could say it's a visual way of writing. I often say that I think of my work as little poems without words, and maybe this was more like a prose about Siena without words. Pages of a diary of Siena. <laughs>